Welcome back, Rise Up 44 here on Nalio Gaming, playing Faded the Silent Oath on the PlayStation VR. Faded the Silent Oath is by Freema Studios. We're jumping right in. This menu is huge. Very cool. So we have chapter select, new game, and options. New game it is. Valkyries, come, ride with me. Listen to me. Wake up! See your wife, Freya? So strong, but she still needs you. Offer! Come. You don't believe in Valhalla. But I don't need you to believe. Only to promise. Your life's thread is spent, but if you are willing, I will lend you another, long enough to return you to her. You would do anything for them. You already have. This is why we need you, why I will give you back to them, in exchange for a simple bargain. Your life, for your voice. Stay with me! We can only do this together. We share the same desire, Ulfur. She's the one. We need her to live. Just give me your voice, and I will make you whole again. Jeez. It's time to let him go, Freya. Papa, no! You can't keep him alive with hope alone. He's gone to the next realm. He doesn't believe in the next realm. He's staying in this one. Ulfur, can you hear me? Your life for your voice, Ulfur. You will return, but you must never reveal me. Gods and men would punish us both. Just say something, Ulfur, please! Can you hear me? Just move your head. Nod yes, if you can hear me. Nod your head and seal the oath, Ulfur. You have my promise, Ulfur. I will return you to life. You will ensure her survival. And she yours. She will live. Ulfur! You're back! They thought you were gone, but I didn't believe it. I love you, Ulfur. I love you. Can you speak? Can you say something? Nope. By the gods. Returned from the dead. But mute? Father, he's here. That's all that matters. Then let us hurry to Cropper. For the clan. For your grandchildren? Can't you think of your own family first? For once? The clan trades its allegiance for my protection and leadership. And your daughter? What must she trade? Freya. It's pretty colorful. 
Oh boy. Quiet. Something. A horse. A dead horse. Wolves. It looks like war. Proper will offer shelter. The walls are strong and Gudbrand is sending support. We will help strengthen the city. Gudbrand? That thief? Must you cling to your spite? I know what I saw. You were too young to understand. He serves no interest but his own. You're oversensitive. Men of power... How are you feeling, love? Can you move your arms? Try to raise your hand. Good. You'll be back to your old self in no time. How's your memory? Do you recall what happened with the house? How the roof fell in? Good. Then not too much injury to your head. Although, perhaps, some memories are best forgotten. There was an earthquake. Or something. I'm not sure what to believe. The gods and giants no longer walk among us, Freya. If that is what you are suggesting. And do you know where we are now, Ulthar? We're on the road to Cropper. I hope Liv is all right. This is crazy. What am I saying? She'll have the whole town wrapped around her little finger by the time we get there. It's Cropper we should be more worried about. Rem Remember when she was learning to walk, and any little thing would set her running when she ran into the there woods. There we go. Oh, how you bellowed at her to come back. <clears throat> When we ran around the bend, there she was, perfectly calm, surrounded by great blackbirds, twice her size. She looked each of them right in the eye, as if she could command them. I can only hope to remain as brave as my own daughter, until we find her again. Starting to rain. Kind of smart. You're gonna answer questions not Oswald! in your head. <gasps> Look, all of Cropper destroyed, and the bridge. Look at the bridge. Oh boy. What kind of sorcery is this? Liv, Sven, the children. Oh the boy. The plan. If Godbrand is harmed, his son is not ready to succeed. Papa, the children. The survivors will be at the lake. Eric, hurry! Here! Interesting beginning. I heard a PlayStation trophy pop. Act 1, When Hope Fades. Ulfur, how do you feel? Can you walk? Good. I wish there was more time for you to heal, but I know you are strong. Oh, Freya. Oswald. I'm sorry I didn't recognize you. Brant, I need to know. Have you seen Liv and Sven? Yes. I saw them come in with Edda. They are safe, I promise. Brant, thank you for keeping our clan safe. I will handle it from here. Our people need me. Papa thinks only in warrior's terms, and still needs convincing. We must prove your strength, or these desperate people will leave us behind. Come, let's find the children. They're right there. Use the D-pad to adjust comfort settings. Rotation, 30 degrees. Comfort helpers. Floor squares. Oh, that's kind of cool. Floor squares. Disabled. Volume symbols. 
that puts things in perspective. That's cool. They were kind of smart for doing that. Comfort helper, volume cubes. Sphere symbols. So I got a sphere around me right now. It just kind of gives me a area. Depth. So you don't get dizzy. Sphere lines. Four symbols. Floor squares. Disabled. Okay, disabled is fine. I think I'm good for this game. Rotation angle 25, 30. What's the highest you can go? 75. Oh, wrong button. Should probably be closer to 40. That seems about right. Look at the big horse. Have you seen Canute? He was right behind me, and then... Uh, that terrible sound. He didn't make it. I'm sorry, Brenna. Is my sister Arrow with you? I can't find her anywhere. No, Kari, I'm sorry. Gudbrand and his support are missing too, I see. I will handle it, Freya. My clan! I know you are hungry. I know you suffer. But I also know you are strong and proud. Every one of you. As your chieftain, I entreat your patience and trust. In return, I promise to provide food for your children's bellies. I ask only that you set aside your quarrels and work with me now to secure this camp, together, as warriors. For now, let us gather what we can, for we leave by morning. Hurry, find the children and bring back food. For this peace may not last until Gudbrand's help arrives. We're searching for Edda. She was with two children. Have you seen them? Try the woods. Careful. There are strange whispers. Thank you. What's up? Some fish. I was hanging the wash and a wind came so strong. The linens blew away and the whole house seemed to fly after it. Come on now, less talk, more picking. We're all out of home. And we all need to eat. Surely the gods are mocking us. What hey, do we do now that winter is coming? We have no home, no food. No one else is coming. Oswald's you, cart was the you last see my kids? the village. All dead. How about you? You see my kids? Strong silent type, I guess. Can't walk faster. Oh, they're picking shrooms. I see how you keep eyeing my basket. Are you calling me a thief? Rations are lean enough without you eating one for every two you pick. You accuse me because it's you who has the guilty conscience. Surely then the end of days is upon us. This would be lighter work if it was ale. 
How can you think of ale at a time like this? Because everything would be lighter if it was ale. <laughs> Just between you and me, Ulther, I'm not sure Oswald knows what he's doing. Maybe we need a new leader. The environment's done really well. For this, like, art style. It fits. Come, let's find the children. This way looks promising. Liv? I'm gonna ask these dudes over here. I tell you, we're being punished. For what? You think the gods care what we do? Well, maybe if you'd shut the door. Shut the door? Against... Against... Giants. I didn't want to say it, but there it is. Where is Godbrand and his men? Have they all perished along with their city? I really wish you could increase the speed of the walking. <clears throat> Liv, it's Mama! Where are you, baby? Liv! Edda! Sven! You made it. I had a vision you were dead. Silly girl, what are you afraid of? Go! Give your mama and papa a hug. They've been worried sick about you. Liv, what's wrong? Your papa is fine now, baby. He just has some trouble with his voice. Everything is all right. Not our house. No, but we can't use it now anyway. We're going on an adventure. Why? We're going to find the safest place. <sighs> All right. Sven, what do you have there? Uh, b b Bo? Uh, we were g going to hunt. That's an excellent instinct, nephew. Your father would have been proud. Where did you find the bow? Th through there? I think he's... Dead. Sven was afraid to touch him. Touch who? A, a warrior. A, a, a c captain. Sven was so scared, he ran away without arrows. <laughs> Ulfur, go see. I, I, I'll i show you. Can I grab a sword? Nope. Can't grab nothing. That sucks. Kinda wish I had a sword. I took the, the bow. I'm sorry. There are kids up there. So hungry. I tr tried to see if he was alive, but I didn't get very close. So he 
He's alive? Uh, I'll go get help. No, boy. Take my things. Kill Gunbrand. Traitor. Ooh, Gunbrand's a traitor. Gunbrand? Th that's the Jarl. G Grandfather said he would help. Aunt Freya doesn't trust G Gudbrand either. Do you think he's a traitor? Grandfather doesn't believe her. He's stubborn. He he's gone. We should go now, Uncle. Okay, so there's a little orb, orb around this circle. It's kind of like a light that shows where I have to walk to next. That's kind of a cool feature. You should take this. It's too big for me. Sweet. You know how to hunt, right? Even though you're not a warrior? Of course. Maybe target practice would be good, since it's a new bow. Wait here. I'll make targets. Should never put a target in front of a hill, because there could be something on the other side, buddy. Try the big tree trunk first. Good. Now the shield. <laughs> better than my teacher. And as a final test, this doll. Good. I think you're ready. The captain should be proud. His bow lives on in honor. L let's go. Collect the arrows, dude. It's Liftstall. She kept hitting me with it, so I took it. <laughs> Did you find enough arrows, Ulfur? Good. The sooner the hunt is done, the sooner we can return to camp. And the captain? D d dead He s said G Gudbrand was a traitor. He is a traitor. And a thief as well. I don't know why Father respects him so. I had a vision last night. I saw a nobleman, a god, and a giant meeting in whispers. Could it have been Gudbrand? Let's discuss this after the hunt. Sven, Ulfur, if I'm not mistaken, these prints are fresh. Uh, I'll help track them. We'll head back to camp and see if we can get some help. Over here! Quiet down, dude. They're gonna hear you. Uncle Ulfur. Why didn't you become a warrior when you had the chance? Eric in the village said you were afraid. But I don't think that's right. When I was little, Dad said you didn't believe in Valhalla. But why? Sorry, I, I know Aunt Freya said you can't talk now. I won't talk so much.
Hold on. Uncle, there. To the left. Yeah, I'm gonna sneak around, bro. Chill. He ran. Darn it. He's right here. Got him. Oh, I blew out his hips though. That was a terrible kill. That was terrible, man. I would have. Oh, he would have been crawling on the ground. Sorry, buddy. That was not a clean kill. I'm sorry. We should try to hunt some more. My bad, dude. I wish I would have killed you in the heart so that you didn't feel that. I wish I could crouch. Definitely wish I could crouch. Yes. What? That was so dope, dude. I definitely did not think I was going to get that kill. That was awesome. There was two of them. Anything hidden back here? But I have a feeling there's something back here. This would have been a cool spot for like a cave with something hidden. But at least you can walk through the brush and the bushes. It's somewhat realistic. It's not just like a invisible wall. That's pretty cool. All right, there's my nephew over there. Maybe I can fish after. I like fishing. Fishing's fun. Let's see. Is the arrow still there? No, nope, arrow's gone. That's too bad. I wanted to see where I got him. It looked like I had a clean kill on him, though. There's no jump, run, nothing else. Just a, a walk, pull up the bow, and shoot.
That's it. Ah, invisible wall. Uncle, there, through the trees. You got it. Let me track it down so we don't leave it wounded. Should be a blood trail. Nice. No blood trail though. I'm gonna check over here real quick before it um progresses the story. Mm, nothing over there. Just more paths through the woods. Your Highness. Hey. <laughs> Papa. Oh, I'm sorry. Can you drag it onto the sled? Take it by the legs. Oh, thanks. Load it up. Queen's orders. Your queen, she knows a secret way back to camp. This would probably make more sense to pull, not push. I mean, this the sled's legs are curved up at the front, back but kind of seems like the leg should be on backwards so you can pull it. Look at the little kids skipping and hopping. That's so realistic. Like that's what a kid would be doing at that age. That's really cool. Oh, they're loading up, getting ready to go. few hours later. Kids are sleeping. If I trust my vision, the Jotnar walk among us again. And Gudbrand, short-sighted as always, trades with them for what I do not know. Giants? Visions? And you drag Gudbrand's name into it too? What utter nonsense. You would have me turn my back on our greatest chieftain, on order itself, for a pile of old wives' tales? <sighs> Ulfur, what do you think? Do you believe in these giants? I don't know, dude. And I can't talk to tell you that I don't know. 
It's either yes or no. And honestly... I'm glad one man still has sense. What? I didn't say yes or no. Enough arguments. No matter the cause, if help will not come to the people, then we must bring the people to help. On this we agree. I thought I would die as I was born in this valley. But our hopes now lie beyond these mountains. The North Road will lead us to safety. We'll move on in the morning. And one last thing. For the sake of the children, can we not dwell on what has happened? PlayStation Trophy. So that's where I'm going to end my first gameplay with Faded the Silent Oath here on the PlayStation VR. Once again, Faded the Silent Oath is by Prima Studio. I appreciate you watching here on Nalio Gaming. If you haven't already done so, please click that like button. Let me know in the comments section what you think. Share with your friends. Follow me on Twitter at RiseUp44 and at Nalio Gaming. And subscribe to me here on Nalio Gaming. So Faded is definitely got a really interesting story going for it so far. I want to know exactly what it was. Was it an earthquake? Was it giants? I really appreciate how they're using the controller rather than the PlayStation Move controllers. Because this allows you with the left thumbstick and the right thumbstick to actually do the walking and looking around rather than using the Move controllers which would have you do the pointing and clicking and having you kind of warp to a new area that you wanted to walk to. I'd much rather do the walking on my own. The caveat to that is I would appreciate if they would add in an ability to walk a little bit faster with L3. Maybe just not a run, not even a jog, just a little bit faster of a walk speed. I understand it might mess with the tempo of the game, but some of that walking in the woods in that first big scene there was it took a bit too long but if that's the only complaint I have for my first gameplay I think that things are going pretty well for this game so far so that was just chapter one I'm definitely looking forward to jumping in and playing chapter two I'll definitely post it on Nalio Gaming for you all to see please let me know in the comment section what you guys think so far click that like button and I'll see you next time thanks for watching